And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. It was sure a hot one today. We reached a high of 88 degrees here in Lafayette, but just look down to our south, a high of 90 degrees, and that is what's coming our way for this week. We're going to see temperatures in the 90s. However, tonight we saw a couple stray showers come through the area. Nothing substantial once again, but the shower chances diminish, especially after midnight, which means I'm expecting a dry night ahead. Also, a stretch of 90 degree weather and isolated storm chances with these warmer temperatures and more humid conditions. Taking a look right now at downtown Lafayette, we're looking at 78 degrees, clear skies with winds coming from the east northeast at 5 miles per hour. Tonight we're going to fall into the lower 70s across the area, 71 for Logansport, 71 also in Delphi, 72 Frankfurt and also for Crawfordsville. Here in the Lafayette area we will have a low of 71 degrees. Seeing those partly cloudy skies all in all, it's going to be a calm and pleasant evening with winds coming from the east at 0 to 5 miles per hour. To start off tomorrow, it's actually going to be a perfect morning commute, 71 degrees at 5 o'clock in the morning with partly cloudy skies, climbing up to 72 at 7 in the morning. Once again, turning mostly sunny, staying mostly sunny at 9 in the morning, climbing up to 75 by then. Tomorrow morning, we're going to start off 79 degrees at 10 in the morning, already at 82 by noon and surpassing our average high of 85 degrees by 2 p.m. in the afternoon. And then we're going to reach a high of 90. This is 5 degrees above our average for the time of the year. And by the time we get to 6 o'clock, we're looking at a temperature of 89 degrees. So all in all, it's going to be a toasty day tomorrow with highs in the 90s, 90 for Delphi, also for Frankfurt and Attica, 91 down in Covington. Future cast shows tomorrow will have a dry start, seeing just some clouds lingering around, but we start to see rain chances come into play once we get to lunch hour, seeing a couple spotty showers, and then they'll start to see that chance for an isolated shower and thunderstorm even through the evening. This shows Monday at 7 p.m., and then we'll start to dry out a bit and have a dry start to your Tuesday morning. This shows Tuesday at 7 o'clock. But Tuesday, it's only going to get warmer. We have a high of 92 degrees for Lafayette, also 90 for Monticello, and also up in Winnemac, 92 degrees down in Crawfordsville, 93 for Covington. So we're actually looking at quite a bit warm temperatures for the rest of the week, a high of 91 degrees by Wednesday, seeing thunderstorm chances as well as we head off throughout the next seven days. Now, notice they are small percentages, and that is because we see when we have higher temperatures and very humid air mass, we have a chance for a spotty isolated shower for the afternoon hours. So this is going to be very hit and miss. I would say until Saturday as a cold front moves through, that's going to drop our temperature to a high of 89 degrees. It's not much cooler, but we start to see more scattered showers and thunderstorms by next Saturday. I would say that's going to be our soggiest day of the week. Other than that, temperatures in the lower 90s. It's going to be a hot week ahead. It's going to be hot and it's going to be muggy and uncomfortable. And gross. And gross. That's about <laughs> all we have to say about that. All right, Amber, thank you. And Caleb, speaking of hot weather, you look like you got a little uh, sun going on here. Yeah, well, I was out shooting the all